Welcome to Okoye Cigar Lounge. I'm Chuck Swafford, and I have a couple of tips for you that you may want to use today. Have you ever had a good cigar, but then something come up and you have to put it out? What do you do? Some guys simply will not smoke another cigar, smoke a cigar once they put it out. They don't care if it's $30, it could be a $50 cigar, they will not smoke it again. But me and my friends, we don't care if it's a $10 or a $12 cigar, but especially if it's a $30 cigar, and I have to put this, this thing out or I have to go somewhere, what do you do? One of the things I do so that I, I don't stink up my house or my car, my clothes or everything, I take the cigar like this, cut it, blow the smoke out, And I take some, I keep an extra bottle or container in my car. For example, I just finished this water bottle, shook as much water out of as I could. Take it, take your cigar, real gentle so you don't mess it up. Just ease it in that, in that bottle just like that. Don't put it all the way down. And then take your lid. Move it in and then take it. Now you got an airtight container that's going to prevent your car from smelling, keep your house from smelling. And then when you go back and dips, and because it has a little bit of moisture, some drips in there of moisture, keeps your, keeps your uh, cigar humidified. And there's a good tip for you. And then when you're ready for that cigar, you just pull it out like that, light it up, and you're ready to smoke. There's other containers that you can use also. I've taken this one. This is a bottle. This is actually glass. And you can see the head is a little bit open, more open. So what I do, I take me a little paper towel and put it in there with my cigar. Put my cigar in there. And I use that paper towel just to keep the cigar from moving, from bouncing around in there. Put that top on it. Airtight. I got a container. I got like a little travel humidor. And then when I'm ready for that cigar, There's a tip for you. Thank you for the cigar and with Chuck.